I'm not sure what was the last thing I wanted to do. So I'm just going to unpause, press a bunch of wrong buttons, and look at the world at large to see maybe somehow we potentially get rid of the kid. Oh, very good. We can go for more infantry, more rattle and defense. Or we go for uh, attack in, in melee techniques. But I think we should really press our advantage because, I mean, it's a good question. Should we spend really harshly or catch up everywhere else? Because we're already far ahead in infantry mechanics. So let's go some military techniques. Let's get melee techniques up and also do something about our siege equipment there and it still leaves us some room for points um, maybe get all these up to at least one so that's a good idea I hope we just need to remember not to switch our capital anytime soon because we're going to leave all these lovely technologies behind again. So what are we doing right now? Oh, right. We were trying to get this piece over here still. You have 2,000 troops. I have more 1,000 troops. But you are a tributary state of this thing. How did you become a tributary state of that thing? It would be a truce breaker, so we shan't break our truce. How did we get this? Must be some inheritance thing. What can we do about you? Just claim this piece down here. Still can't establish a tributary because we do not have majesty high enough. It doesn't even say here. Let's say, declare war. Majesty level is equal to two. Yeah, that's interesting. Doesn't say that you unlock this. Usually it tells you over here that you do. But you don't. Alright. You're researching cultural tech, it's not going well, but... At least you're trying. Can't do anything about the hospital unless we go up to construction one, which we, I think, would be able to do. But then again, we're more interested in stuff like trade practices and castle infrastructure to actually give us a boost to money and not spend it. Let's make this man our spy master. He's a strong vassal anyway. <clears throat> Should we try and go back to producing a claim over here? Let's try and get a claim on this duchy again. I don't think we will, but... Might as well try. Our dynasty is still going strong down here. Not here though. Our ancestral lands! Uh, who do we have pacts with? Not ideal. Still no one wants alliances. Because we're just that strong. Everyone is afraid of us. As well, they should. I'm really sorry he's mangled. I don't think he's going to make it very long. The fat mangled cannibal. The light breeze is going to kill this man. Truce is expiring. But 
they could call in these guys to help, but they are very small. We might finally be able to push our claim up there and actually get it. The Dancing Plague. Alright. There we go, our castle is done. Let us build a castle town in it. To start making back some of that investment. How big are you? Not so big anymore. Like you're losing anyway. Let's press our claim finally. We could subjugate, but that way we would just get another king title that we would lose uh, in succession. So. But before we do this, let's check Harriton's laws. Okay. Don't have the technology yet. But we could switch this if we can just convince our vassals to like us. This guy is easy. Bit of money. There we go. Now we can switch this. Elective gavel kind you don't want. Well, let's read through it anyway. Because I feel like... titles of the ruler are divided among the children and the primary heir who is elected from Yana. That, that's not great. So we want to go for agnatic cognatic, meaning both women and boys can inherit, allowing us a little bit more leeway. Again, we're not going to get the technology in this ruler's lifetime to switch over to primogenitor. So we'd rather do this to extend who can potentially inherit. Look at all these daughters suddenly becoming eligible. And that's pretty good. People are going to be upset about it a little bit. Uh, but that's okay. Right now we're not looking at too much unhappiness in the realm. Well, lover has broken up with us. Right, so now let's press our claim. No one is going to come to his aid. We could call someone in for our aid. How much money do we make? 14 gold. We can afford our troops up, which is always quite important. As you might imagine, if you want to do war. And we'll go immediately for this. Uh, let's... Consolidate troops there. Why did you change color? Did they change color? Like they changed color. I did take a bite out of this guy. I think. Right, we sand these down because we can't walk them from there and we raise them up back here and them over there and we hope everyone arrives within a reasonable amount of time protect the general of the heavily emperor addresses a letter to the brave king of the king of may help be with you it has come to the attention of the merchants of your lands have been acting with deceit and dishonesty Oh no. We send our marshal to deal with the troublemakers. We only get a lower city tax here. Oh 
Let's hope no one runs into anything. Or rather, let us make sure no one runs into anything. Apparently someone runs into something here. Why do you make this little... At least let's, the, let's have the king lead this uh, silly little force. Doing silly little force things. Alright, let's send these in, up immediately. Our daughter is a mastermind theologian. And we will most certainly marry her to this man. She does have a hair lip though. Yeah, she always had that. It seems to me that hair lips are very, very common in Crusader Kings. Then these guys there. Don't want an alliance with us. Maybe if we joined his war, maybe he would think different then. Build a little third army out of these. And the smaller side, but that's okay. So he is out there somewhere fighting something. And he's being beaten, so he's not really a threat. We can take this in peace and quiet. Though I have a feeling we're going to die very soon. It would be a bit of a shame. Trail and all the weird things. I grieve for my daughter. But she has made a good match. You need to be careful with the um, Agnatic Cognatic because sometimes it just so happens that oh, he's facing rebellion. Something we could profit from. Probably, but we cannot because we have levies raised as it stands. You need to be careful with this because she is in line, but her children are not going to be of our dynasty, so. We need to make sure that our grandson and our son remain alive. walls for our new holding. Oh look, he's sending troops now. He wants to retake this. We're no longer honest. So what that means for us. Alright. They're already leading. Going to move these over there to fight him and potentially capture him as he moves his troops in here foolishly. Look at that! Okay, they only have some 60 people, so that center had no realistic chance of doing anything. Ah, well, we got a count out of it. A duke, honestly. 
who we cannot ransom because he has no money. Let's move these guys over here. We get a little bit of an overview of this area as well. How many troops do you have? Thinking on this, we might be shooting ourselves a little bit in the foot here. If we get a border to them, yes, we can subjugate ourselves into their service. Fair fealty. But also, we open the door for them to just, you know, take our stuff forcefully. I'll have to wait and see. Might even be able to usurp this title there. Oh no, our Chancellor was murdered trying to get us a title. Well, at least he was really trying. Our cousin is a good commander. We have a strong vassal in need. Yeah, let's give this man a chance. Go fabricate a claim there. Enjoy. Good luck. Let's bring these home and stand them down already because we're almost done anyway. They can start on the retreat. There we go. We're not going to finish the sieges. We hold this now, usurp it. Oh, we also can't create it. So how much would we lose? We lose this duchy, this county, this county, and this county. What if I give him that county up there as it stands? We would still lose a bunch of stuff. Everything we would lose before. He's ugly. Oh no. Retinue's home already. <clears throat> These soldiers are stood down as well now. So who's dangerous factioning? How much? No? Who are you? Look at this guy. We could imprison him. What plot are you doing anyway? Fabricating a claim on the kingdom. It's definitely going to be war. Definitely. We're not going to get the luck of imprisoning this man. Oh, that's fortunate. Well, that should put a dampener on this faction there. Get a new region going. Our dear Marshal. Who needs to be a little bit pampered, this man? What poet? What tutor? Our wife, of course. The hunchbacked military genius.
And we need a new Chancellor. Because he has become incapable. Oh, come on. He can do his job even like that. No problem for us. So how are you doing? 5,600 versus 11,000 and... Oh, you're sort of winning. What could we do here? Just border disputes. Not really worthwhile. Claim. If we had the duchy title, we could press that claim. But we don't, so we can't. And we build another castle town there. Our brother has come out of hiding. Why am I trying to kill him again? I'm not. Bastard needs a focus. Let him be that. Not in any faction, so we don't really mind him plotting around. Doesn't like his accommodation. Into the oubliette he goes then. Let's uh, shop around a little bit. Where could we potentially go to get some money? Up here looks good. Or we just go into the area with the rebellion. Siphon off some funds. Because he hates us anyway. What do we mind? An upsetting rebellion doesn't matter to us. Are you in a faction? Yes. Get out of faction. Boy. I don't like to obligate or threaten or anything if they're not actually in a faction already. Can we get more red news? Yes, we finally can. Some skirmish rep news, so more archers, a little bit of heavy infantry. I would like to add these at some point, but I suppose building up more keeps is going to do it eventually. Our Chancellor had his son inherit, so his son shall take over in our attempts to get a claim on this duchy down there, finally. Through sensible... Oh, we are the able? Okay. Through sensible marriages, you can also extend your realm a little bit, uh, as happened up here. Because a countess or... Her father or something... I don't know. Something happened here, which was sensible. So we took... <laughs> Quality advice. 